Welcome everybody to the Reviews from Hell, I'm Andreas and today we have a video that I should have done probably earlier. I haven't been taking too much pre-workout lately, you know, I just wanted to clean up a bit. I haven't done a video in a while of this kind of stuff, but I'm here today. We've got the BSN and the Rush um, pineapple flavor. Here we're going to do obviously the taste test, but before we do the taste test, let me just see what's in it. Now we've got niacin, 32 milligrams. Uh, panth uh, pantothetic acid, 6.3, um, creatine, beta alanine, it's got 2 grams of beta alanine, uh, 3 grams of creatine, which is quite good. I don't know which kind of creatine it's got in it, it's probably monohydrate usually. Uh, 200 milligrams of caffeine, which is absolutely brilliant, spot on. Uh, black pepper extract, yeah, it, it says on the bottom it is creatine monohydrate, uh, which is probably the best one. Uh, and that's mostly the it's big big you know ingredients in here anyway so BSM I've tried BSM before I was happy with my results in the past um, now let's see <coughs> Ooh, yeah when you open this thing don't smell it straight away let that you know just that smoke just come out because fuck my ass it is very very strong anyway it says here let's see how many scoops okay mix one rounded scoop in 230 milligram mi, mi, yeah, uh, minimum ml whatever that it says of cold water recommended consumption one serving per day okay so we get one rounded scoop in a glass it's less than a pint more than a half pint Hopefully it tastes good and hopefully it doesn't, oh, sorry, hopefully it doesn't get stuck on the bottom. I just don't, I hate that with pre-workouts, I hate when you get, you end up drinking that last little bit and it's all crumbles and stuff like that and it just tastes awful. Oh God, get your head away from the glass. Go mix that baby good. All right. Now, now we've mixed this up. Always remember, have cold water ready. I didn't, and I'm just gonna use some ice cubes. Same thing, really. You know, just make it extra cold. The last thing you want is to drink a bloody warm pre-workout. Oh, God. It could be the best pre-workout you've ever had. When it's warm, it's fucking undrinkable. All right. Okay, I do see a bit left on the bottom. There's a really tiny little patch. Maybe that could have been avoided though if I had mixed it maybe just a bit more for a few more seconds. Um, it looks kind of thick. It is, it is a bit foamy on the top, not too much though, but that's usual when you um, when you mix it with, you know, a blender like this. So anyway, cheers guys. Holy shit balls. Oh. Oh, okay. There's something in there, I'm not really sure what it is, that burns my throat. I'm not sure if I put too much pre-work in it. It did say one rounded scoop. Um, I added some water, I'm gonna test it again. Maybe with added water, it, you know, loosened up the taste a bit. Okay. With the added water that I put, I would use this section. So I would use this in a pint glass. If you have anything bigger than this, it would be better. It is a lot better once the taste is a bit diluted. Um, as I said, this glass here is maybe not, it isn't big enough for the dosage that it wants, which is okay, it's not too bad. The taste isn't bad, 
it's just got the, for me anyway, it has this burning sensation in the back of my throat, which <coughs> it does kind of stick with you. But um, nonetheless, it's okay. It's not the best. It's not the worst I've ever tasted. Um, it's for 30 servings. It's quite cheap. This is less than the 30 euro price tag, which is decent for a pre-workout, at least in uh, Cyprus. I know probably if you're looking at this from another country, I might even sound a lot, but in our standards, that's quite, that's quite decent. Um, I'll let you know in the comments below though, um, how, uh, if it works and how good it does work. And I have in mind, I have been off pre-workout for a few months now. So this should, this should really give me a good kick in the head, um, if it does what it says. So guys, I'll let you know, and until then, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, even if you did or didn't like the video. Till next time, see ya.